Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Vigilante, and you're watching the Vigilante Effect. And what you see right now is Batman Arkham City. Um, the game. This is the sequel to Arkham Asylum, which was an amazing game. I never even got to speak about that game. But Batman Arkham Asylum was a unique and amazing, not just superhero game, but game in and of itself. So... <clears throat> This is going to be an unboxing. I already opened it. I got it yesterday uh, at 12 o'clock. Um, the purpose of this unboxing is going to be basically just to display to you the difference between getting it from uh, certain stores. What perks would you get? And in this case, I'm going to be speaking about GameStop and some ways for you to basically... Um, some things to consider when you're buying a new game as opposed to just saying, you know what, let me just go buy it from wherever. You know, you might actually want to do some research. So, through my research, uh, for me, the best place to get it was for GameStop and pre-ordering it. Now, mind you, I never pre-ordered any game whatsoever, but this was actually the first game I actually pre-ordered because I saw the benefit in it. So, they have this program called um, uh, Power Up Rewards. It's a Power Up Rewards program. You pay like $14 uh, for, for a year, and you get this card that every time you use it, when you purchase any game from them, uh, first of all, on pre-owned games, you get 10% off automatically. Every single game that you that you get is 10% off. And they have a point system. Basically, um, let's say you buy uh, uh, a used game for 15 bucks, you might get like 400 points or something. And then they have rewards based on those points. So not only are you getting a discount, but you would be getting a, uh, a reward points for possible rewards that you can choose from. Now, it's mainly geared towards uh, pre-owned stuff, but in this case, they had an advertising saying that if you would, if I would buy this game uh, pre-owned and pay in full, whatever, before October 16th, then I would get double the points, which means I would get like 2,000 points for this, which is pretty good. This is a pretty good deal. Um, so that's for me personally. Another thing that, uh, that they had for the pre-owned was they had a um, a map pack. Let me take it out. Well, here you go. This is the game, obviously. <laughs> and they had a, uh, a code for the Joker's Carnival map, which is basically going to be a, a challenge map, you know, uh, similar to Arkham Asylum, where... You were, you had to face off a bunch of uh, enemies in one room, and basically it's the same thing. Um, I'm assuming. So that's one map. It's the the Carnival Challenge map, and you got you get that for free because because of the pre-order, and you also get a uh, Batman animated series suit if you are Power Up Rewards member. So for me, I was, and I pre-ordered it, and I got a Batman uh, suit, which is basically the the cartoon version. I'm really interested in seeing how that plays out with the dark theme of this game. Uh, so I'm really interested to see how they actually incorporate it. Also, of course, you know what you get with it is the... Let me see. Um, the Catwoman as, as a playable character if you buy it new. And, you know, you get a code for it. So I'm assuming if you buy it pre-owned, obviously you don't have... You cannot play with Catwoman unless you buy her. Um, so... Catwoman is going to be a playable character in the game. She actually has a unique story with unique objective, uh, objectives that add on to uh, the whole story of the game. So a lot of people suggested that you download this before you start the game at all. So just so you can get a full idea of what's going on. Also, in addition, the uh, uh, um, what's it called? GameStop, they also had what is called Gotham Knight movie. It's the Gotham Knight movie. This comes with, usually comes with the, the uh, collector's edition. They give you a hard copy. Um, and the collector's edition has a lot of stuff that are <clears throat> unique to it. <clears throat> but as far as content, as far as I'm concerned, for me, it, it doesn't really make too much of a difference. Like, they might have one extra suit, um, which they actually do. They have, um, uh, the collector's edition has Dark Knight suit. Um, but for me, I don't have Dark Knight suit, but I do have... The animated series suit <clears throat> and uh, so anyway so i get the gotham knight movie but as a as a digital copy um so they give me a code for that and um so that's basically that if you if you would go look uh, on best buy i think best buy gave it gave you uh, uh the exclusive costume of or the exclusive robin as a playable character if i if i remember correctly 
But then I was tempted to get that, but looking at and comparing the differences between the two, I felt GameStop gave me a lot more perks, um, especially for the fact that I was a, a pro member. And that's basically what I went with. So if you like this this uh, unboxing, just uh, or it's not really unboxed, I already opened it. <laughs> um, just give it a thumbs up. And uh, if you're not subscribed, subscribe already. You know, what are you waiting for, seriously? And also, this is basically going to be how my unboxings are going to be. It's not going to be just pointless where I open the box and you see that, obviously, oh my God, there's a CD inside. Well, duh, there's going to be a CD inside. But it's going to be uh, more of a discussion about uh, where I got it and what perks did I get out of it. All right, this is the Vigilante Effect. Hope you enjoyed. Peace.